The Western Conference Semifinals Game 1. The Pelicans are coming off a dominating four-game sweep in Round 1. Will their confidence finally be tested? Tonight, they go up against Sacramento. The opening game of the Conference Semifinals, up next. Two survivors in the West. Yes, sir. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Reg Dollar. Welcome back to the Golden My NBA Series. We're in the second round. Sacramento taking on the New Orleans Pelicans. Brandon Ingram and Zion Williamson taking on the other Duke brethren, A.J. Griffin and Reggie Mack. It's up. Herb Jones inserted into the starting lineup for the Pelicans squad to guard. Reggie Mack, so he's going to be chasing him around all game long, and that's going to be the matchup to see, I think, overall in the second-round matchup. Not on her versus him. Him, the prodigy. Reggie Mack, the franchise. It's time to get this underway, though. Latrell Cross, Jonas Valanciunas. About, about time for tip-off. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. You know what time it is. I put in on some gameplay, be some instant hardwood classics. So we might be in store for a good one, a great series. I think we're in store for a Benedict Mathen driving to the basket, pass out to Zion. B.I. goes baseline and finishes with the two-handed slam, setting the tone to start off the series. Now Reggie Mack pops after the screen and knocks down the little elbow J right there, getting a the bucket to go at his spot. You could just count it. But Herb Jones defended him, playing pretty good defense. Finds Tyrese Halliburton. He pump fake. Steps back on Brandon Ingram and knocks the jumper down right in the face. He said, face down. Let me hold that. Now Reggie Mack gets his, gets his screen. Nice little poise. Gets his way to the basket. Finishing with the right-handed layup. As crafty as it, as it could get for Reggie Mack. A little pick and roll. B.I. and Zion Williamson. And they got, they got A.J. Griffin defending Zion Williamson right now in this game because they wanted to add some little size and strength to him and I guess I have Brandon Clark be the help defender but Z Zion get his way to the basket and finishing over the top of Latrell Cross and AJ Griffin Tyrese Halliburton throwing up to throwing up the lob to Brandon Clark and he's elevating I want to go higher throwing down the alley-oop now Bryce McGowan's with the spin move passes out to Reggie Mack pump fake Gets a step on Brandon Ingram and just lays it. 12 already in the game. Reggie Mack is in an attack mode and it's scary. That is a dime right there. Rifle pass to Zion Williamson for B.I. in the corner. The chemistry that they have is special. For a missed shot, rebounded by Brandon Ingram and it's blocked by Reggie Mack. Now they're out in transition. Reggie Mack has the ball and goes right at Dante and he finishes right over the top of him. That's 14 in the game for him. Defense turning into offense and a pinpoint lob from Dante Mack to Zion. Now pump fake by Reggie Mack gets to his spot in the mid range and rises over the top of the defender, and that's 16 in the game in the first quarter for Reggie Mack. And Zion Williamson throws it down right over Keldon Johnson, and they got some little history going back to Duke. When Duke uh, dominated him in the first game of the season by 34 points, but Latrell Cross throwing down the lob, pinpoint pass by Reggie Mack. Now CJ McCollum in the second quarter knocking down the three. Pelicans up by one. Herb Jones on Reggie Mack. He gets his spots and just rises right over the top of him. It doesn't matter who's on Reggie Mack. He think he could get a bucket. He think he could get 50 on anybody in this league. A nice little running hook, hook by Latrell Cross. And now CJ comes off the screen this time. Nice little pace again to the basket, changing speeds, and getting the layup to go. And now he gets a little pass by Jonas Valanciunas, and he knocks down another three. He is heating up in this second quarter right now. Now Benedict Mathen pulls up for three. Yakum. Oh man, the Pelicans are on that run. They're on that run. CJ gets a flare screen. CJ for three. Yakum. Count it. Another one. 13 and a quarter for CJ McCollum right now. And now Reggie Mack gets a screen. And he's trying to weather the storm. And he knocks down the three. Now Benedict Matherin. Yakum. Count it. Another three by Benedict Matherin. Him and CJ McCollum are absolutely wilding in the second quarter right now. And CJ again. He knocks down another three. 
Now he comes off a screen. Tyrese Halliburton playing the passing lanes, and now they're out on a fast break. Lobs it up to Latrell Cross, who's one of the best rim runners in the game right now. Turning defense into offense. CJ McCollum penetrating, finding Benedict Mathern in a corner for three, taking his time and exploding the net. Now CJ gets a double screen, pulls up. Right over the top, I think who was that? Rui Hachimura, Keldon Johnson. Getting at all three levels right now. And now B.I. getting to his mid-range spot right over Rui Hachimura. And now great defense by Dante, stolen away. And now B.I. in transition. Nobody stops ball, and he just rises and fires. And it's a three-point party right now for the Pelicans. If Zion hits a three, then it's absolutely, it's over. But Keldon Johnson off the dribble, pulling up. That ain't his game, but he knocked it down. That's a big shot. Now he's wide open in the corner for three, and that's another big time shot. A little 6-0 run to close out the second quarter. And now we're in the third quarter. A.J. Griffin, who's been quiet, finally knocks down the three. And now offensive rebound by Jonas Valanciunas, stripped away. Pass it to Tyrese Halliburton. He lobs it up to Brandon Clark, and he throws down another high-flying alley-oop slam. Herb Jones right now picking up Reggie Mack full court. And Reggie Mack passes off to Tyrese Halliburton, gets the handoff right back, goes baseline and throws it down with the left hand to slam. And now he's talking his shit. Now A.J. Griffin catches and fires from three. And it's a, it's a six point game. The Sacramento Kings is up right now. And now they're on a run of their own. Reggie Mack getting the screen right, getting the screen, pulls up, Zion drops back, Yakum hold that. Oh, that Reggie Mack turning up right now in this third quarter. Zion getting the rebound, goes in and out, drive past everybody, throws down a hammer time slam. Flying through the air, Zion Williamson. It's a one point game. Zion gets in the post, has Rui on him. He's he moving him. Oh my God. That's bully ball right there. Baby. We got rock the baby. Step back, Davion Mitchell. Yeah, mm, knocked out. Knocked down. Give me that. Now Benedict Matherin has it. Finds Brandon Ingram and he dunks right over Davion Mitchell, little ass, little ass boy. And the Pelicans are back on the run. Now they're up by seven. Bi gets the screen, attacks the basket, and rises right over the top of the trail cross. And now Reggie Mack going. Crossover on Herb Jones gets to the basket and designate right over Sky Clark again. Two points right back. Look, he took that one personal. Step back, Sky, Sky Clark knocks down the three to put them up by 10. Dante Mack getting his shot swatted by Latrell Cross. Nice little separation, though. I'll give him that. But a weak ass finish. Now Zion Winston goes behind the back on AJ Griffin, goes between the legs, double between the legs, and then cross over and gets a two handed slam. Now Reggie Mack, nasty crossover on Dante, step back action, and they're right back in the game. Six point game. Reggie Mack going to work in this little ISO. And now Tyrese Halliburton lobs it up to Latrell Cross, and he's back on the board. I think that's 12 in the game for him. Screens for Reggie Mack. He attacks Jonas Valanciunas and throws it down right on top of him. And it's a two-point game. Tied up. They double-team Reggie Mack. They work it around. Tyrese Halliburton attacks the basket and finds Keldon Johnson with the finish. And Sacramento's back on top. Reggie Mack has the ball. Has Benedict Mather and Gardner. Brandon Clark sets the screen. Pelicans in a scoring drought. They double team. AJ Griffin for three, and he knocks it down. Rebounded by Reggie Mack. Five point game. He's out in transition. Nobody really stops ball. Now he lobs it up to AJ Griffin, and he finishes with the finger roll. The playmaking by Reggie Mack in this fourth quarter right now. That was a great pass to AJ. I didn't even know he was about to pass this him. Now it's stolen away. Pick pocket by Tyrese Halliburton. With Cheryl Cross throwing it down. And it's a nine point game. Sacramento is on the run. Now Benedict Mathern going in and out on Reggie Mack. Spinning. Blocked by Reggie Mack. But rebounded by Benedict Mathern. Blocked again. But Benedict Mathern stays with it and gets the, gets the finish. Now they pass it up to Reggie Mack. Has lockdown takeover. 
Now we're going between the legs, sizing him up a little. Gets the switch. Jones Valentunez, they send the double team. Goes behind the back. And it's time. <laughs> it's time. May I have this dance? Gets it to Latrell Cross. And he dunks it home. Reggie Mack just creating so much gravity. And now a one-handed tomahawk slam off two feet. Nobody stops the ball. What the hell are they doing? I'm letting anybody. Somebody got beat me, but other than Reggie Mack. That's unacceptable. Zion wants to taste it to the basket and finishes. And now Brandon Ingram also attacking the basket, but gets fouled by Reggie Mack. Good foul right there. They can cut it to a one possession game. B.I. at the free throw line, knocking down the first one. And has 22 in the game. Now Reggie Mack defended by Herb Jones, sizing him up. They send a double team with Zion Williamson. Pass out to Brandon Clark. He shoots the three, and he misses it. And it's out of bounds. The Kings ball still. So 14 seconds left on the shot clock. They don't have to foul. Plenty of time left. They get it out to Reggie Mack. They're already sending a double team. Pass it to Tyrese Halliburton. Gets the ball right back. Iso, it's time. Mano e mano. Not on her. Behind the back, Reggie Mack loses her, pulls up. Her can't guard him. Pull up, dagger. Reggie Mack losing her. Jones on that behind the back as he was trying to go right. And they started sending a double team. Nasty behind the back. Herb Jones didn't even recover. And he delivers the dagger again to his mid range. Now they have to play the foul game. I know y'all hear the chance. When was the last time we ever seen someone in Sacramento get MVP chance? Reggie Mack is one of them. Best franchise players since since Chris Webber. Delivering in a clutch. 40 points. Eight rebounds and eight assists. And that'll do it for game one. Sacramento wins game one. And this is shaping up to be a great series. Herb Jones, you got some feeling to watch, buddy. Because Reggie Mack giving you, was giving him hell. He was giving everybody hell. Getting to the rim was in attack mode. What I like to see. Tyrese Halliburton also had a lot of great plays, especially on the defensive end. A couple steals with Trail Cross doing his thing. Brandon Clark, everybody really showed up. Showed up enough. But a dominant performance by Reggie Mack. Getting to the basket, throwing it down no matter who is down there. 48 and 8 and one steal and three blocks. That's special. Special. And on the other side, Zion Williamson, 28 points. B.I., 22. Seed McComb at 21. Bennett and Mather, 19. So it's tough losing that game for the Pelican squad. The Eastern Conference Semifinals, Game 1. Orlando are coming in off an arduous seven-game battle in Round 1. The intensity has been heightened. The stakes raised. They are now in the hunt for a Game 1 victory against the Pistons. The opening game of the Conference Semifinals, up next. Now we're moving on to the second game. In the second round, we got the Magic taking on the Detroit Pistons. The Pistons sweeping the Pacers in the first round, and the Magic upsetting the Raptors in seven games. Classic series between those two. But the Pistons, 61 team, looking to take care of business again and make it back to the conference finals. This team looks like they're on a mission. Cade Cuttingham, Paula Bancaro, Tyrese, Tyrese Smith, Sadiq Bey have a lot of experience together already at a young age. And it's time. Going up against an inexperienced young squad, but that doesn't throw their experience out the, out the window, really. They beat an experienced Raptor squad. The Magic, led by Jabari Mack and Victor Wimbenyama, looking to do the unthinkable. They win the tip, and it's time to get the game underway. Johnny Davis and Jalen Suggs are the two X Factors for the series. If the guards could come to play again like they did in the Raptor series at timely moments, they can complete this upset. But Jalen Suggs getting it, throwing up the shot to go. But like I said, Jalen Suggs and Johnny Davis, they're both two-way players. So if they can limit the backcourt of K. Cunningham and Tyree Smith, they could for sure win the series. But 
Tyree Smith throws a lob up to Oyeka Okongwu, throwing it down with the right-handed slam. Now Jabari Mack in transition. Has a deep bait, goes around him and lobs it to Victor Wembenyama. He's so special, bro. Now, oh my god, that was a nasty spin move. Electric spin move by Jabari Mack and finishing with the finger roll. Quick as hell. Now Tyree Smith pulls up right over the top of Victor Wembenyama. You know how much arc you got to get on that to get over the top of him like that and not get blocked. But Paula Bencaro sizes up and knocks down the three-pointer. Well, spots up and knocks down the three-pointer. But Johnny Davis pulls up after Tyree Smith backs up and gives him too much space. Now Tyree Smith, nasty crossover, stunning Jalen Suggs and throws it down in the vicinity of Victor Wembenyama. He ain't scared. Going right at him. Now K comes off the screen. Defended by Johnny Davis. Steps back in the mid-range and he knocks it down. What I love about K, because he got the three-level game to him, the poise, and the playmaker. He's so special. That's a that's a beauty. That's a beautiful shot by Jabari Man. Beautiful shot. Now Ty Tevin Wilson goes right around Paula Ben So I guess I guess it is this is the defensive center that everybody was talking about, right? Kate Cunningham with the crossover with Victor Wembe. Yama sending it to half court. God damn. Now Jalen Suggs lays it in right there. But one of five start for Kate Cunningham right now. Not the best start. And also a one of five start for Paula Bencaro. And Victor Wembe. Yama knocks down the three. And Orlando is up by eight to start off the game. Not the start you expected for the Pistons. But Buddy Hield off the bench, getting a bucket, knocking it down for three. Paula Bencaro passes out, and Buddy lets it fly again, and he knocks it down. Now it's a tie point game. Well, back to the two point game. Tyree Smith snatches back, creates so much separation, just rises and fire for the much improved three point shot. We got to see this again. Spin move, pull back. Mm, I'm going to let this go. <laughs> Too much space. We got to see it again. Spin move, pull back. Mm. I'm going to let it fly. Yakum, count it. Give me three. Go right past Mo Bamba and put him in the rim. Jabari Mack. A little rocker step goes baseline and throws it down right over the top of him. Let's see that again. Oh, my God. Nice little shimmy. Mm, get in the rim. Dummy. In and out. Nice little in and out step back. Has Luke and Thor defending him. And Tyree Smith. Pickpocketed that pass. I mean, well, seeing that coming. Interception. Again, the dunk to go. And then a Tomahawk slam. He may be trying to provide the spark they need to break this one open. Throwing it down. And now he he's defended by Jalen Suggs. They find Oyeka Kongu and he rips the rim rocker. A rim rocker, the rim shaker, whatever you want to call it. Jabari Mack has Sadiq Bay on him. Stepping back right here. Or side stepping again to Bucket to go in the mid range. 11 in the game for Jabari. But the Pistons are up by seven. Great strip by Jalen Suggs, but an and one. Paulo recovers it. Now K Cuttingham in transition. Oyeka running the floor. Great defense, but a great second jump by Yucca Kongu to get the putback slam to go. Now K is doing whatever he can to get his way to the basket. Oyeka goes back door as Victor Wembenyama had his back turned, and he gets the alley oop to go. Tyree Smith in transition. He stops. I don't know what the hell he's doing, but nobody stops the ball. And he lets another three go. 13-point game. The Pistons are on a run. Jalen, I ain't not Jalen. K Cunningham finally Paula McCarroll in a dunker spot, and he rips the rim. Now London Price finds Jalen Honeycutt. Victor Wembanyama has a mismatch, and he scores it. 10-point game. Now Tyree Smith. Goes spin move, passes out to... K Cunningham now. K drives to the basket and Mo Bamba for three as the shot clock is winding down and it's a 15 point game. Now Johnny Davis just pulls it for three and he knocks it down. Much needed bucket. Orlando needs to get some stops. And now they swing it to K Cunningham. Victor Wembenyama closes it out, but it's not enough. K knocks down the three and they are on fire right now. 19 point game and Victor takes out his anger and throws it down on K Cunningham. Now Tyree Smith getting past Jalen Suggs, pump fakes two times, swings the ball around, Paulo for three, and the Pistons, everybody's starting to heat up right now. It's electric. 
Now Johnny Davis getting to the basket. Blocked by Bancaro. Sadiq Bay getting the screen right here. They throw it out to Paulo. He shoots right over the top of Victor Wembenyama. And you know what time it is. The Pistons win comfortably in the second half. 47 point second quarter for them. That's ridiculous. 26 and 12 for Victor Wembenyama. 20 for Suggs. 20 for Reggie Mack. It's your boy, Reg Dollar. I hope y'all enjoyed this game one. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. 500 subscribers coming soon. I'll see y'all in the next one. Stay safe. Be golden. I'm out of here.